All right, guys, welcome back to another monthly upload. Recently, I've just been trying to brainstorm on what new video ideas I could come up with, some interesting perk builds that no one's done in Dead by Daylight before, and, you know, I stumbled across the idea of just playing some regular games as Survivor. That's got to be the fastest I've ever loaded in. And we got Coal Tower. And it's a plague. So I decided to also play some Steve since meaning Steve was kind of a promise I made a long time ago, even though we all know where my promises lead. I also brought a med kit and I got to figure out how to use the whole thing, even though it's a plague. Because if you survive now, it doesn't matter if you use your whole item up or not, you, uh, you lose all your add-ons. This Clydette's doing a really good job. What the fuck? Decent teammates in solo queuing? 2020. Oh, pfft. I don't really want to get thrown up on. We'll probably keep going that way and then we run this way <laughs> epic mind games also for everyone going down in the comments about to bully me for running spine chill i'll have you guys know spine chill is probably one of my favorite perks these days just because it it's such a counter to pigs wraiths ghost faces you vault faster uh, the perk is just overall amazing all right third gen <laughs> i'm loving this survivor gameplay oh she finally got her first down are you making me sick? What the fuck, Jake? Slap me. Just give me a boop. Never. Uh, wh what the fuck? Oh, impressive. Ow. <laughs> oh my God. It's okay. She's got something pulled up her sleeve, dude. She's gonna completely annihilate us. Alright, here comes the DS. Never mind. The slug. My precious slugs. What are you gonna name the Claudette Plague? I need a pallet. Pallets? Or have you guys used them all? Uh, I can't make it to that team. Wall, what the fuck was that? That's what you call a panic. Oh my god, your mind games make no sense. I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> pallets! Well, that's what you get for being so thick, Steve. You and your fucking luscious hair. I like Kobe in your face. Or not. <gasps> Why am I so good at this game? Alright. Well, we're fucked. Or we're gonna bounce. We're gonna get the complete opposite side of the map from this plague. And I take it back. <laughs> oh, God. Where is the infinite? That's the only thing I can rely on because I'm terrible. Oh, my God. I'm gonna have to use my dead hard. <laughs> Yay. Leave me alone! <gasps> I feel like she's gonna go back to the one on top of Pole Tower. So I feel like that one's a lot closer. She has her power. Alright, Claudette, let's dip and uh, turn into a bush. You're good at that, right? Shut the fuck up! We have to wait out her power. And this person's already in second! You're not gonna go to the complete opposite side of the map for me, are you? I'm gonna cleanse on the opposite side of the map. Just so it doesn't screw my teammates over completely. Still gotta be careful of Noed. She's not the best plague, so there's a chance of her having me. it. Yeah. Claudette? <gasps> Suck a dick, dude. Well, it was nice knowing you, Jake. Just gonna uh, be a little sneaky. Yeah. Okay. That's not terrifying. I probably should have gone in there. <gasps> Bomb rush! Oh boy! Come here, Claudette! Wait, where did Claudette go? This isn't even 99. I would have been dead. Girl, I'm gonna heal up. And then maybe take a hit for her, and she's out. What the fuck? Actually solid teammates. Oh, that kind of makes sense. <laughs> when did the rank system start looking like a rainbow? <laughs> Suffocation pit for the second map. What the fuck? These are two great maps. Yui? Hello? I know you're there. Oh my god, Dwight, not you too. Do I have to wake up my whole team? Dwight! And here comes the dead... Dead ringer? Yeah, the dead I'm ringer. Back, baby. You come back at the perfect time. Dwight, I got you! I got a med kit. I want to use it. Ugh. Fuck. Wait. Wait, oh, I got injured. What the fuck? That took a while for me to... Your house! Right. Dwight! Ah. Oh, this is fine. All right, Dwight, touch my ass, big boy. Never mind, he's still here. Looks like I will be running a marathon. Oh. Well, it was nice knowing you, Dwight. I am gonna actually get some use out of my med kit this game. <laughs> Two gens are already done. 
Yeah, this is baby David. You M1 legend? No, don't worry, I'm not the killer. It's okay. Don't panic. Hello. Oh, that's the killer. David! I'll take a hit for you, big boy. I need my med. Fuck. Oh god. He has to reload. Oh! Where's the door? Fuck! Tree? Tree, you might. I am very clumsy. Let's just put it that way. There he is. I swear oh to god. god. Look, I'm gonna be screaming like a little bitch, but I. Deathslinger is by far the scariest killer in this game, at least for me. Uh oh. Gen jockey down. Oh. Looks like you pissed off a crow, Mr. Deathslinger. Is he actually coming back to this side of the map where all the gens are already done? I mean, this would be perfect. Yeah, never leave the side that gens are still being worked on. If you just go to one side where, like, everything's already done, you literally just give the survivors an advantage to do the objective while you're wasting your time on some useless Steve. Actually, wait, we might have just three gen ourselves. Yep, yeah, all the gens are on this side. I am big brained. Uh oh. Oh god, this guy just. Oh, here he comes. Is he gonna get Yui? Nope, he's gonna keep the. I got you. Why am I doing this? Why am I being toxic? And he doesn't care. Wait, can I finish this while he's here? I'll go down for it, probably. You serious? Oh. Uh, uh, I'm not good, like, okay, you know, I will take the hits, thank god, I got you, Dwight, I also got my med kit, oh my god, dude, you're actually a legend, can I make this, I can make this, uh, and if I get shot here, it'll probably suck a lot, well, they started the timer, are you DCing, hello? All right. Touch my ass. And do not carry me to the, oh my God. Deathslinger, why? You actually had really good accuracy, except when you missed all the shots on me. But for the most part, it was pretty good. I don't. The Temple of Purgation. Honestly, not even a bad map as well. So I decided to bring a purple flashlight for uh, the final game, even though, uh, do not expect me to hit any flashlight saves. It has been so long since I've actually tried to use a flashlight effectively. And already on the gen, toxic gen rushing. Oh, he's on his way. Can we finish this? David, you fucking bitch, get back here. Oh God, it's a legion. He's gonna stab, stab, stab us all. Where the fuck do they go? I'm gonna fucking dedicate. I'm running the, uh, the ultimate injured build. Um, I'm confused? <laughs> and just like that, <laughs> two gens left. Oh god, Fang. Fang, tell the Legion to wait! You'll never see me right here. You're a fucking idiot. And you'll see me right here. Oh! Pallet! They'll double back, and we run. How did they not see me? Oh, they're coming back. Never mind. Well, might as well get the save. Run, Fang. I'm gonna take the window and not make it, probably. Unless you lunge? Isn't there like a pallet right here? <gasps> you gotta be joking. This is just too much. You'll probably double back here, but we're going for it. What are you doing? This is how you literally throw the game. Oh my god. The hatch is right there. God, she's so short. It's like impossible to see her. You know what? I don't care if it's toxic. I haven't even used this thing all game. And I'm gonna lose both the fucking add-ons, I just realized. Alright, Legion, I'm gonna blind you a million times at pallets, because that's what good survivors do. First, I gotta make you, uh, get stunned by this. <gasps> Yay. Enjoy. One more time for the picture. Let's run. Alright, I'm gonna walk so I can get my dead heart. The obsession's getting chased. And the obsession is down. Don't pick him up. Is she actually not picking him up yet? I'm probably not gonna hit this. Oh, no. she can't stop no! this. 
I'm gonna wait here. David, crawl. Crawl, David. She's gonna look at the window. Oh my god. <gasps> I got that! <sighs> Poor Legion, man. Well, that was an eventful game. Anyways, guys, I think that's gonna do it for whatever I'm gonna title this video since there really wasn't a theme. I honestly just wanted to play some Survivor and, you know, always trying to come up with ideas on perk builds and stuff just kind of takes the fun away from just enjoying the game sometimes. I also just want to give a really big thanks to all the amazing and just overwhelming support you guys have given me uh, from my return and even before I returned. Something I've always struggled with is just focusing on the positivity when there's, you know, that 1% of negativity out there. But you guys have honestly just blown me away with how amazing this community is. With all the cringe being set aside though, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good night guys. Must have been to 11 when the world ended. At least it felt like it at the time. Teenage years make a heartbreak worse. Plus a lot was going on. Couldn't stop it at the time. Dad tried to flip the house. Funny that it all ended upside down. Known for being optimistic. Started feeling different. Couldn't fix it. Started writing lyrics. All because nobody tried to hear.